Okay, so we're on LiveStation.com where you can get your free player. You just go and register, put in your, use, your email address as a username and a password, and then you can download the application. Once you have installed the application, you will be presented with this screen. Put in your email address and your password, and you can choose for the application to remember the password and sign in automatically. Uh, when you choose sign in automatically, the application will sit in the tray without consuming any resources, but you will be able to receive breaking news and other alerts. Once the application loads, you'll be presented with the last uh, settings from your last uh, viewing, so it will remember the last channel you saw and, and the same position of the window. And so I'm going to show you how to navigate the application. We try to give uh, you as much choice as possible. So you can uh, navigate the application in a number of ways. You can use the menus up here, like any traditional application. You can use the overlay with your mouse by clicking on things here. So you can change channel, look at the EPG and the description of the various channels. Or you can use the right click in the tray. It gives you access to the same functionality. In order to change channel, um, as I said, you can do it from, uh, from the overlay by clicking this button. So you can select the button and click it, or you can select it from the channel list and simply uh, choose the channel you want. It takes around 5-6 seconds to change channel and we're planning to have some uh, promotional content inserted there from the broadcasters themselves. Channel changing is very easy. Uh, my favorite way of doing it is to use the wheel of the mouse and I can just roll it and so you can see I'm going to go and look at Euronews in Italian, my native language. So it's very easy to change channel. In terms of size and position you can keep the player anywhere you want on the screen and by default is always on top so that you can carry on doing your emails. In terms of the size you can stretch the window using the corners in any, any form you like. But we also have some preset um, sizes that you can do jump to using control 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. So for example you may want to have a, a widget size with control 2 and keep it there in the corner while you're doing your emails. You can go full screen by double clicking anywhere on the screen and then pressing ESC to exit or you can also select this icon here, the one on the top right next to the X. Okay. Other options are available in the right click menu or in the top menu bar and uh, the main ones are the ability to, uh, to sign in automatically, run a startup, be always on top and show or not show the uh, the classic menu bar. So we try to make it as simple as possible. At the end of the day we just want you to have a simple and enjoyable user experience by having news on your computer while you're doing other things. So it's all pretty simple. So I hope you like it and enjoy it as much as we do. And please send your feedback through our forum which is open and is available for you to post comments anytime you like. And we are working on bringing you as many good channels as we can. Thank you for your attention and happy watching.